and welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be talking about life in lockdown and the recent changes and the impact on autistic people especially from my own autistic perspective so let's get into the video I felt it was important to do this video to talk about the recent changes to the UK lockdown and the impact that this is having on mental health as an autistic woman I have recently been trying to adapt to all the changes that this UK government has been doing it's been totally confusing and they seem to keep changing the rules to everything. I understand that we are all having to live through a difficult time right now, but what the government does not realise is the effect that this is having on my mental health. As I rely on structure and routine to fulfil my day, I feel that my needs have been totally ripped upside down and again I do not adapt to change easily. It's made me feel more isolated than I ever was before and the government do not seem to care about people with disabilities which under the Autism Act of 2009, we are meant to be including our needs. I feel that the government has totally lost touch with reality and with people who have disabilities. I have felt more anxious this lockdown because they have not made anything clear so how are we meant to understand? I have slowly started adjusting to the lockdown because I have been focusing on my YouTube channel to keep me busy and help promote autism acceptance and since we have been allowed slowly to go out, I have been meeting up with my best friend outside for lunch which has helped but in the evening time the feelings of loneliness and upset return and my emotions are rushing everywhere to the service and before lockdown I was doing my volunteer work which helped me to maintain a sense of self and my mental health was doing good I knew what I was doing and I had structure and routine to go through my day now this is all gone and I'm struggling I would love it if the government would offer more support to disabled people such as myself because I feel they have not cared at all and if they want disabled people to be on side with them and they need to speak to actual disabled people because they are changing everything just when I've slowly started adapting to the changes. This lockdown has been tough. Having to be away from my family like never before, I felt this I have felt never this alone. And it seems that we get good being able to achieve one or two steps to see people and being social and then everything has to change. When will we be able to live our lives again as normal or supposed normal? I want to be able to go back to my volunteer work as it gives me a sense of self and main structure and makes me feel like I'm part of the team and I'm achieving things. I want to be able to go back to my autism social support group. That is something that I've relied on for these past five years and having it once a month is my vital support network. Now that's been taken away from me. I hate this lockdown and what it's done to me and to other people. I've had things that I've enjoyed taken away. Please Boris, let us have our life back. Please end this lockdown and the local lockdowns. The only positive thing that's come out of these lockdowns for me is that it's taught me to be more independent and more stronger. But for my mental health has not been great. I've really struggled and it's really made things difficult for me. Prime Minister, please can you explain to me how you tend to offer support to people like me and many other people across the world right now who are struggling with mental health or autism spectrum disorders. I hope to hear from you. Thank you for watching, guys. Please like, comment, share and subscribe and I will be back next time. Bye.